Beautiful for sure, but behind the colourful facade lies one almighty problem. As we all know, broom impacts on farming, forestry and biodiversity. But lesser known is our work to tackle this pest plant by utilising biocontrol agents. 037 is 17. And here at a site in North Canterbury, our staff are setting up trials and experiments to look at the impact of one of those agents, the broom gall mite, introduced back in 2008. It's a really tiny um, thing called an area fired mite. It's microscopic in size and it attacks the new shoot growth of uh, broom. And this area fired mite causes the plant to produce these galls where you might get normal shoot growth or normal branch growth. And in this particular plant here you can see parts of the plant have actually died and we can see at this site within three years of the mite being released here we've got uh, whole plants dying as well as parts of plants dying from the attack of this broom gall mite. So what we're trying to do is look at the relationship between the mites, uh, possible fungal infections or other pathogens, and the impact of the mites on broom plants, just individual plants rather than the entire population at this stage. But we also have trials up here looking at the impact of broom gall mites on entire populations of broom as well. And while the work is taking place near Hanma, staff from throughout Manaki Whenua are taking part. My role is to uh, ensure the project is uh, well coordinated because we uh, have uh, collaborators, lots of collaborators on the project. So myself is an agrologist, so I work on mites, so the main player in the system. So we also have fungi, uh, which uh, we have uh, uh, Sarah Dot, who is a pathologist, so she's also in the project. And then we have Quinton, who is uh, in, in the beet weeds team, so uh, he, he plays uh, another uh, role in the project. And then we have Hugh and uh, other people who are all sort of part of a big sort of uh, efforts trying to fight the weeds. And assisting the team is student Varshamala. If yeah. even, even from distance, you can immediately... Previously a student at the University of the South Pacific in Suva, she's now using this project for her master's degree through Auckland University. I didn't know at first that it was really a problem until we went to the side field and then we saw the amount of infestation this broom is doing and it was like, wow. And interestingly, Varsha was recruited to participate as part of the Landcare Research and Auckland University Joint Graduate School in Biodiversity and Biosecurity. While there's no broom in Fiji, there certainly are efforts underway to utilise biocontrol agents to combat pest plants, and it's in this area that Varsha sees her future. Yes, it is a field that I am very much interested in, as I've always had interest doing environmental work and going into environmental side and research side, so yes. And it's fair to say her experiences here will hold her in good stead.